Hello my beautiful beautiful viewers, welcome to the first ever video, today we're going to be playing a game called FTL, which is a fun little indie game about flying through space and screwing shit up. So let's dive on in, we'll have a new game, oh, what should we name our shit? I feel the blackers is in order. What is our crew called? Fleeshy, Gurk and Banks. I'm not going to bother changing their names because you can't beat those names. That's a that's a first class crew. Start. The data you carry is vital to the remaining Federation fleet. You'll need supplies for journeys to make sure to explore each sector before moving on to the next. But get to the exit before pursuing Rebel fleet can catch up. Okay, so we need to get, get here to the exit beacon. Try and escape the rebels and get as much scrap to upgrade our weapons and whatnot on the way. Let's let's jump into the distress beacon. Help all those in need. The distress signal is coming from a small space station orbiting an inhabited planet. The satellite defense system has gone haywire, and the repair crew can't approach without being fired on. They're looking for help to fix or disable. Let's 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 tactically shoot our guns and try and. You fire a few volleys but aren't able to penetrate defense system shields. If weapons have no trouble pissing your zone, you take minor damage for escaping. Oh god, that is a terrible start to our journey. Well, let's let's delegate some some positions. Garrick can get on the shields, and Banks can get on the on the guns. Let's fire up our weapons in case we jump into any bad bad people. Off we go. An advanced Rebel automated scout. Remain station near a rebel station. Sensors indicate it's a storage vessel for military goods. Oh, we could always do some military goods. Let's attack the ship and try and get hold of those those goods. Let's fire a missile at the engines and a burst laser straight at its weapons. Try and deactivate it. Thanks, is charging up the guns. Oh, they fired a laser. Oh no, our row 2 system's out. Well, we've destroyed their ship, so we can focus on repairing our own. Salvage what you can from the broken ship. 24 scrap, that's not bad. Station is storage site for military grade weapons. You find one can easily be attached to your ship. Let's repair our oxygen, then we'll see what we've got. Good job guys, we didn't run out of oxygen. It's always a plus. Pike beam cuts across entire starships, assuming there's no shield. Beam damage is reduced by one for every shield it passes through, which allows the partial shield piercing. That seems quite helpful. I think we'll we'll buy one extra power and a, and a power bar, so then we can take off our Artemis and fire up the pike beam. Look at that! We'll be the scourge of the uh, the galaxy with this. On completing your jump, you receive a message from a nearby ship. Greetings and welcome to our beacon. For a small fee, we'll let you continue on your way. Not happening. I'm not paying no fee. Let's take take some power out of the med bay, because I don't think we need it yet. Put it into the engines so we can have some extra dodge. First laser at the web at the shields. And then we'll wait for the pipe beam. We'll, we'll wipe them out with that. Well, I hope we will anyway, I've never used one. I'm sure it'll get fine. Banks has got it. Let's fire away. Alright, you in. Here's some equipment from our stores. Leave us alone. Nah, they wanted us to pay. We'll make them pay. Right, the burst laser. We've wiped out every, every compartment now. There they go. Ship exposing substantial collection of useful scrap material. Jolly good. Well, let's, let's check on the ship first. Yeah, we all look looks in good order. Let's jump to the nearest store so we can sell our Artemis if we're not going to be using it. Buy some other good stuff. Let's get rid of that. Long range scanners. Weapon pre igniter. Now that sounds good. Weapons are made. Immediately available after an FTL jump. Oh, we could do with that, but we can't quite afford it. So let's fix a ship. Some long range scanners. And uh, off we go. Here we go. We can see there's a ship there. Let's, let's jump in at him. 
Oh, how do we end up in a nebula? Here's an automated rebel scout who's position within the nebula to warn of your passing. Oh god, we need to take this sucker out. Let's fire at his cockpit so he won't be able to fly anywhere. Come on, Banks, it's all on you. Charge up the weapons before they can fly. Fire the pike beam. Ah, oh, I didn't take down the shields, did I? Oh, this is a tough little ship. Alright, the shields. Oh, those missiles. Eat this, suckers. There we go, we took him out. Thank god, that was, that was a hard fight. Ship breaks apart and you feel the relief and the nods, you'll hopefully be one step ahead of the fleet. Okay, well let's let's just check the ship, like repair the door control and other bits that got damaged in that fight. Our sensors are down because we're in a nebula, so we can't see our rooms unfortunately. I did hear some depressurization somewhere in the ship, so back here. Yeah, let's try and get that. They are slowly, slowly dying. Okay, get to the med bay, good job guys. Charge that up. All the while, Fleeshy is sitting at the front of the ship, commanding. Right. Good job, guys. Back to your posts, fire up the engines, be on our way. So, so, yeah, let's go down here. We'll, we'll keep looking for ships. Hopefully get some more scrap out of them. You detect an automated rebel scout attacking a smeral fueling outpost. Well, hopefully they'll give us some fuel if we, uh, we help them, so let's intervene. Destroy the scout. It doesn't even have any shields, so... I'm feeling quite confident with this one. Ooh, an iron blast, I'll take out our shields. Oh, God. Here we go. Let's finish him. The ship breaks apart and you quickly salvage what you can. The outpost hails you after the scout was destroyed. Thanks for the help, we've been harassed non-stop by the scouts. Take this on the house. Good guys, wow. Nice to meet some friendly people in the galaxy. We've got quite a bit of time, actually. The rebels haven't really caught up, so we could have a little investigate before we get to the beacon. Jump into a calm part of the nebula. Whoever you relief fades as a rebel scout. God, they've got a lot of these, haven't they? This one's got a missile. Missiles go straight through shields, so we're going to take a few hits. Ah, oh, straight out in the weapon system, the pike beam's down. Let's get that up. All up and running. There we go, we got him. <clears throat> Ship explodes, even behind a substantial collection of used scrap material. Getting a lot of this, it's going well. Do we have time? I'm gonna risk it. I'm gonna try and save the people. So we're in a nebula at the moment. Well, we were, so... Find source of distress wall. Small research station appears small laboratory fire got out of control. It's threatening to destroy a station. The fire suppression system is not responding. I think we should dock. We could try and help them. If we might get trapped there if we send a shuttle, so we'll, we'll dock. Pull up alongside the station, cut through the hull. You're able to rescue a few survivors, but many more are lost. Yeah, one of the survivors off to join your crew. Who have we got? Oh god, he's, he's a bit odd, isn't he? Jones. Oh, I think I know what the species does. They give one power to whatever room they're in. Let's take out the engines and he should put it in. That means we can fire up the med bay and the pipe room. Well, welcome aboard, Jones. Glad to have you. Let's fly back to the gate now. As quick as we can. The long range beacon is almost hidden with the nebula. There we go, we've made it. We've made it to sector one. Yeah, I'm gonna give you guys control now. Do you wanna go to the NG controlled sector or the pirate controlled sector? If you wanna leave a comment in the uh, section below, give us a like, subscribe if you want, if you liked what you saw, of course. Black is out.